Hey guys, my name is Chris and this is my 125 gallon. I've got it stocked mostly with haps along with some peacocks and a couple calm species of Inbuna. I got this tank up and running about a month ago and uh, for sure plan on stocking it more. Uh, some of these guys in here I've had close to a year. I kept them in a 90 gallon and I had some issues with them all packed inside of a uh, 4 foot tank and they really seem to be thriving inside of a 6 foot tank now. Uh, let's go check them out. Alright, first one I'll show you is my Morii. Some people call them a blue dolphin. Uh, he seems to have a tumor on his face. It's popped kind of like a pimple. It had pus come out of it a couple of times rubbing on the rock. I plan on getting that checked out, but other than that, he seems to be perfectly healthy. Uh, this is by far my favorite in the tank right now. This is my Fusco. I got him from Ron Cichlitz, and he was worth every penny I paid for him. Absolute gorgeous colors. Uh, he's around six and a half, seven inches. Uh, this is the newest addition to the tank. I got him on sale for 50 bucks from a local pet shop. Uh, this is my Vanessa. Put my hand up here to show you how big he is. I'd say he has to be at least eight to nine inches. Uh, he's close to full grown size. Here's another Vanessa I got. Uh, this is one of the other fish. He was about two inches when I got him. And I was hoping he was a male when I got him, but thank God he is. So I have a female in here as well, and I plan on adding them into a breeding tank soon once they mature up some. This is my electric blue hap. Another one of the older ones I've had. I heard they don't get much more over five to six inches, but hopefully he does because his colors are absolutely beautiful. I have a second electric blue hap in here as well, and he was he's only about three and a half inches. Can't find him, but here's my super red empress. Uh, he's kind of taken over as a tank boss. I got him from Ron Sickles as well. Uh, he's not too aggressive, but he kind of shows a lot of dominance sometimes. This is the X, or uh, what well, he used to be the tank boss, my OB Peacock. After adding bigger haps in there, he kind of uh, jumped down off the throne. He kind of chills in the corner now. A little, a little sorry for him, actually. Uh, this is my uh, Dragon Blood Peacock. This is one of the other original fish I got. Absolutely beautiful colors on him. This is my, uh, what I've been told is called a William Mbuna. Picked up from a local pet shop as well. Uh, seems to be a calmer species, so I kept him in here. He don't chase around like uh, some of the more aggressive Mbuna do, which I had to take out of the tank. Uh, I had a uh, parasite outbreak about two to three weeks ago, and this is my living stony, which is still recovering from the parasites. I added proper medication. Hope he recovers soon. I feed him Norfin a uh, three millimeter. Get them active for you here real quick. They absolutely love the stuff. Feed it up. I started them out with Norfin or uh, not Norfin, but a uh, new life spectrum, and I decided to move up to a bit larger pellet. Uh, the tank's filtered by a Fluval FX6 and a Sun Sun 304 canister filters. I have two uh, free C power heads as well, and it keeps the tank pretty clear. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, like and subscribe, and I'll be planning on making more videos soon. Later, guys.